said you might You said you love someone I said you tried You said I'm done, all done I think you lied You said you need someone
Awesome. Thanks so much for coming in. It's great. It. Thanks, man. So, um, I guess really before we uh, get into the album, let's talk about how you guys get started. Uh, it actually started as a two-piece, just AC and I, back in 2005. Uh, lived together for a couple weeks. Both played guitar, knew each other through college. Decided to write a little EP. Just the two of us put that out online. Did a couple shows. Did like Troika. Played some shows with friends. So. Took, took five years off and found these guys. <laughs> Slowly it's been adding members. <laughs> Every couple months we had somebody. So how did the band grow from two to six? <laughs> well, found the drummer first. Uh, we had a good friend of ours originally on bass uh, that's actually getting ready for law school. Found us this guy who's amazing. Uh, playing shows. Danny came out to quite a few shows, knew him when we were starting the band. Played lap steel, other instruments, and he hopped in at one point and uh, decided we wrote some songs that we thought cello would be good, and got Kendall to come sit in. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, I usually don't really ask this kind of question, but uh, I was wondering the history of the band name. What is what is Jack the Radio? <laughs> I feel like I'm taking all these. <laughs> That's you, though. There's there's not really. I mean, it's we we liked it because it had multiple meanings. Um, Really started out, was in a band in Charlotte years ago, and we, we took the time to think of a band name by writing lists and just emailing lists of names, crappy, whatever they were. And uh, Jack the Radio was kind of a leftover name that we had on the list, and uh, AC so, and I decided to use. So we got the leftovers, right? Yeah, I think we were just much. sitting in your house one night, and you were like, uh, this is a list of the names that we have, yeah. and how about Jack the Radio? And I was like, sounds cool. Yeah, started just kind so of we'll that, a revolt yeah. against what we were hearing on the radio, yeah. decided to do our own thing. So Jack is a verb. It can be, and then it kind of turned into a uh, kind of turned fictional into a, character. A character, yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's a guy. That we're now fighting with our music. So. <laughs> that was kind of the question that, you know, as I've told people, I've had Jack the Radio, and they're like, okay, is that a, are you jacking the radio, or is, it, is that the radio's name? <laughs> yeah. So, okay. There is, there is yeah. a character now. Yeah, there is a character yep. now. <laughs> Check out the website. Yeah. Yeah. He's on there. He's, he, he's there. The he's got a, yeah. All right, so um, five years later, you got the band together. Um, now you're releasing a full length, uh, Pretty Money. Yes. Um, tell me about that album a little bit. Yeah, like we spent the last year kind of recording it in different uh, pieces, like three songs at the time, just uh, for financial reasons, I guess, and kind of just took the last year writing and recording it. Yeah. But, also, it really pushed us uh, to kind of take our time with it. And I mean, we wrote probably 20, 30 songs last year, and uh, every couple months we'd go in the studio, do three. Uh, Warrior Sound in Chapel Hill and pick kind of the best three that we had at the time of however many we had. How did you pare it down from 20 to 30 songs to, to what you got? I mean, is there, a, is there like some certain thematic elements that kind of fit together a little bit better or anything? What'd you say, Brent? Just, <laughs> just Mud Rock? That's the, the thing we were going for? Yeah, Mud Rock. One guy at a show called us Mud Rock. Yeah. And, uh, that tied in a, lot, a little bit, but when Danny joined it, because yeah. he joined, mid pretty, yeah, pretty. And that kind of helped the sound grow a little bit. That's the that slide <laughs> process. Kind of yeah, guided a bit. Yeah. Kind of pushed me to play more slide too. Which is so the nice. sound kind of developed through the record. Yeah, it's kind of cool. So you kind of hear that development from in that album. I hope so. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> there were some. I mean, I would say you know, with song selection, there were. I wouldn't just call it intense negotiations, <laughs> but there there were quite a few where you it's know, like, like yeah. some of us really dug these, some of us really dug these. And you know we ended up with 15 recorded, 12 going on the album, yeah. and and there's still every once in a while we'll hear one of the ones that's not going on there and go, man, I really like that song. <laughs> so hopefully they'll hit the light of day at some yeah. point. Uh, I was gonna say, are you? Get, is there plans for any other releases? I mean, I know that your the, the focus <laughs> is on this one, but I mean you've got so much material. Yeah. Like, uh, any EPs? Oh, another another full length this year? <laughs> uh, probably not this year. I think we really really liked how uh, recording three songs every couple months really worked out. And I think we're just going to keep doing that. You know, we'll release the record, and hopefully a month or two later we can do uh, another batch, and maybe a year later. But I mean, we've got tons of songs. Like Danny just said, we actually did 15; only 12 are going on the record. Uh, so we've got quite a few that uh, we've got in the, the wheelhouse or the spare. <laughs> the basket. So um, now, how in, in the, the original two guys? Uh, how has Jack the Radio evolved from just the two of you to this full band? Like, how has it how has it changed? Obviously, there's there's new instruments involved, but beyond that. Yeah, when when me and George started, it was just both of us uh, 
with acoustics and we actually had a laptop in yeah. between us. Really old uh, computer. Yeah, really old laptop between us doing like uh, Fruity Loops, like really simple beats. And uh, so I'd say that we've come a yeah. long way. We started yeah. more, I think, as a front porch band to yeah. more a backyard band now. Yeah. So
remember we were running from the law.
cry.